guys, Rangatan Staunch here. Today we're going to be going over the new trading methods since the DLC update. If you do like this stuff, please hit me with a like and a subscribe and we'll get straight into it. So first thing you're going to need, just like old times, is an arena workshop. You want a car stored on your workshop level and you need a friend in a private session that's in Titan of a job. So first thing we want to do once our friend is in Titan is head into our arena workshop and grab a car and drive it out. Once we're outside, we're going to line ourselves up with the garage door and we're going to go into our friends list and find the friend that's in Titan. Once you're on your friend's profile page, you go down to now playing GTA 5 and you're going to click join. You're going to decline this first one. And now you'll notice when you press the PlayStation button in really quickly twice, it's going to bring up that join page again. So we're going to go back into the game. We're going to drive straight at this garage door. We're going to double click the PlayStation button and spam X to go through all of the invites. And that was a bit late. Oh, I got my interaction menu open. Okay, so that's how you do it. And then once you're in this black screen, while the loading screen is actually going, you want to hold down your interaction menu before this black screen even comes up because 90% of the time it isn't going to put you into the Titan of a job menu and then you quit out and it makes it look so easy. No, you're going to be put under the map. It's going to be really hard to deal with stuff. So once your interaction menu is open, like old times, you go down and kill yourself. And as you can see, we're now glitched, no map. And we can go to our normal trade spot and complete a trade. So once you're at the spot like usual, you're just going to call in your MOC. You want to be facing the wall to make sure it spawns in the street behind you right here. And once it's spawned, you want to call in your free car. If you want to get your map back during this glitch method, you get your friend to take cover on the back of the MOC. You're going to walk into the circle. You're going to hit circle and walk away. As you can see, your map is back. You can pull your weapons out, everything like that again but you are still glitched. So once you've called your free car, you're gonna get your friend in the passenger seat who's gonna open the map in the pause menu, and you're gonna drive in the back of the MOC like usual. They're gonna get kicked out of the car. You're gonna reverse. You're gonna to switch to Franklin twice and say no. And you're gonna go down to the MOC and enter alone. So this is going to put you into a black screen. You're going to wait one, two, three seconds down on the D pad, up on the right stick. No. And we're invisible in the middle of the street. We're going to head over to the car that we're going to be getting. Jump in. And just like usual, we've got the car, we've been traded, and we're in the MOC with it. So this is a working glitch as of the 22nd of July after the new DLC patch. It does take a little bit of time to get used to this new glitch. It is hard and I would recommend making a new private session, invite only session with someone every time that you do it. If you use the same invite only session, it only seems to allow one person per session to get glitched. Thanks so much for watching guys. If you like what you saw today, please like and subscribe, smash those buttons for me and I'll see you in the next one. The lesson learned is self-acceptance Like I wanna face the world and leave myself defenseless A wordsmith, I've been slaving like a young apprentice Always wanting knowledge, but I'm never showing up to lectures Betches, that I'm building up the new defenses Fences, but I'll never give you something senseless like